Kalen Salcedo, who is like, you know, vocally defending all of that shit. Um, and now I'll, I think a little bit of it is projection because, you know, that went on. So she's like grabbed onto the Vic stuff is this like mea culpa sort of thing to try to like clear her name. But like I said, that stuff's been litigated and, and gone over numerous fucking times. Yeah, I mean, if anybody has any questions about it and you want to call in, I'll fucking I'll answer them. But I, I have nothing really to say about it other than I didn't know. And I, I'm, I'm really sorry. Like, fucked up. I didn't know, you know. But what are you going to do? Um, yeah, he was sucks. a piece. Of, he was a gigantic piece of shit. And it's good that he's no longer in this world. You know, I'm just uh, I'm just glad he did it himself and it wasn't somebody else that had to do it, you know? Um, exactly. No one but, else. No one else had to go to jail <laughs> for that. Yeah, exactly. Uh, but as far as as Mars Girl is concerned, uh, Kaylin is, you know, she's when I say she's a good person, I mean, she's a very good hearted person. You know, she's she'll take care of you if you're her friend uh, type of person. But my first interaction with um, excuse me, with the Weeb Wars was uh, was actually on Kiwi Farms. And I started looking around. I was like. Uh, what the fuck's going on with Kaylin? Like, what, what the, what the fuck is all this shit they're posting about her? And I started looking into it, and it was right around the time um she started to sort of rattle the saber about suing um, uh, what's his name, Umbrella Guy, um, yeah. And I started looking into it and started posting about things like, hey, Kaylin, you want to like fucking explain this to me because I'm really confused. And she sent me this, dude. She sent me this long ass message about how. Uh, how he was harassing her and, and saying bad things about her and and all this other shit. And she said, none of it's true. And he's and he's getting hurt. He's doing a harassment campaign and all this other fucking shit. And I'm just like, damn, this sounds sounds serious. Like he's plotting things against her. I'm just like, all right, what the fuck? I have to look into this. So I start looking into it and I start watching like everything like a shit hawk, like I autistically do. And I didn't find anything. I got kind of pissed off at Kaylin. Uh, I really did because everything she told me wasn't true. She was upset that she got made fun of. That's what she's upset about. And I, I don't know how to explain this to someone other than in the harshest way possible. Your feelings don't fucking matter. You know, I, you're, you're upset because you got made fun of. Well, boo fucking who? Okay. You like, the, the parody is legal in this country, no matter what you say. It's the and internet. the fact that it not only is it the internet, but it's legal in this country. Like this country has some of the strongest protections for for comedic works out of every country in the world. Um, and I've taken advantage of that. Uh, many of us have taken advantage of it. And the fact I've that taken you're advantage on the of it. we're taking advantage oh, yeah. of it on this stream right now. Fucking I. But the fact that you don't want, but the fact that you're not happy about what happened about you being the butt of a joke um that irks me you know i it's fine don't be happy about it whatever be embarrassed be 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 angered by it if you must but don't don't go around telling people that you're being harassed and and people are are, are, pla are plotting to harass you and, and they're making your life miserable because that's not true okay the only one person that's making your life miserable is you by continuing to interact with these fucking guys and the fact that you made me sit through fucking umbrella guy for like six or seven hours of his fucking content and i gotta listen to that southern drawl and i'm from new york city hey yo guys. i i like can't Tug. do it <laughs> i like Tug, but I, I get you i get you no I'm, I'm not saying he's a bad guy or anything you guys can like him all you want i don't know the guy but i don't like his content because i'm just like all right guy like get to a point i get it <laughs> but what the fuck are you saying um it's you know for a new yorker it's it's not my style of content it's it's a little too drawn out it's a little too slow it's a little too southerny for me and it's just it's not my thing but the fact that i had to sit through it and listen to it and i listen and, and by god that i listened to it and i and and let me tell you something with that fucking southern troll i wanted to fucking hate the guy i really wanted to hate the guy and i could i just could not do it because a he seems like a pretty decent fellow and then B, nothing he said was untrue or wrong or harassment. And I'm just like, oh, come on. Literally, this boils down to you being mad because you got made fun of. Like, come on, really? Really? Yeah, Fuck and it off. got to the point that, uh, like, Tug and Yellow Flash noticed that she was getting super mad about it. So what did they do? They, of course, made entire streams just making fun of Mars Girl. They called her Arms Girl 
and photoshopped her arms to be even longer than they were in that that uh, one picture. Well, I mean, listen, you're gonna. I don't. I, I like this is a lesson you learn in like grade school. You know, if you're being made fun of in grade school, getting angry about it is only gonna make them is only gonna make is only gonna egg them on to make more fun of you. Like, it's just gonna blow up in your face. Just fucking ignore it and walk away from it. Go, go focus on something else. Be the better person, as it were. Don't go down to their level, as it were. But she she went down to somebody. She went down to a different level. Instead of, like, making fun of them back or, or trying to be funny about it and trying to be cool about it, she decided to go full-on butthurt SJW. I'm going to sue everybody in the world. And it's just, uh, all right, well, have fun, I guess. But I'm, I'm going to be over here, like, not supporting you. Ah, thanks. <laughs> exactly. It's, it's crazy a, that she a, tried to drag you into that whole thing. She didn't try to drag me into it. I, I stepped into it because I, I cause she was my friend. And I decided to, you know, like, I reached out to her and said, hey, what's going on? Like, what, what's, what's happening exactly? And she sent me this whole fucking... By the way, all I did was ask her about what's happening. And she accused me of not liking her and being mad at her and helping them make fun of her. And I was just like, time out. Hold on. <laughs> I didn't do anything. I asked you what was wrong. Hey, you fucking like dumped on me, honey. What the fuck? So, you know, here we are. Um, it's just like, uh, what do you like? What do you say to somebody who's just on the brink and just fucking dumps on you and then accuses you of like being part of their side and you're not even on anyone's side? You're just confused as fuck. Like, what the fuck are you supposed to do at that point? Like, ah. Uh... I'm sorry. Could you could you take some clozapan or something? Like, what's what's wrong with you? I, what the fuck? <laughs> like, Jesus fucking Christ, man! I just it, it's it's so weird. It's like everybody I've known from Channel Awesome has been just the derpiest human beings to ever walk this fucking earth, and a it's, walking, it, talking dumpster fire of a human being. Uh, that would describe about ninety nine percent of the people I knew from Channel Awesome. Yes. 